that time again. I'm on the way to uni. I'm at uni today, half 11 to half past six, which is a very strange time, but that's fine by me. I've got a lion, I'm happy, I've got my tea. I'm only in today and then I'm off tomorrow. And then Wednesday, we've got our poster presentation. So fingers crossed, it's gonna be a great day today. poster presentation day. I'm a little bit nervous, uh, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't sleep very well. I woke up quite a lot thinking there were spiders running down my back. Whether that was actually happened or not, I don't know. But it happened in my head. Uh, so yeah, I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie. I went to bed last night, practicing my speech, and it went really well, and I thought, Do you know what, I actually know what I'm talking about. It's gonna be okay. And today I woke up and I'm just, oh, I've got my tea, so. So how are we feeling, guys? How are we feeling? <laughs> Not good. Nervous. Nervous. <laughs> We've got how long? What time? About 10, 20, 15 minutes. About 15. What? What, what time is our time? <laughs> We've got 30 minutes. <laughs> oh, okay. 30 minutes left. See. <laughs> Until our poster. Hopefully it's going to go good. I feel positive. We've been practicing. We're positive, we've got the A team. Well, I'll only feel better after after the presentation though, but at the moment, no. not good. We're going to be alright. <laughs> Teamwork. Good Team luck to work. us. Yay. Good luck! Yay. Yeah. We're finished! <laughs> How do you think it went? It went really well, guys. It went good! It was so it good. went well. We were nervous. I was like this. <laughs> Shaking! <laughs> <laughs> I was so we, scared. We did well. I was scared. But we've done, I think we've done well. We've answered yeah. all the questions. Yeah. I think we'll get a good grade. Do you? Yes. What would you rate us out of 10? 11! <laughs> presentation's over but I've woke up this morning just overthinking it and you know where you just sort of reflect back on something and it's getting worse and worse and worse in your head as you're going through it and I was thinking god do you know what I should have said this different I should have said that different so I need to just try and push it out of my head now and forget about it because we can't change it we can't amend anything what's done is done but overall I think we've smashed it like we've said everything we've covered everything we were on that and we've given so much information that we can't we can't have failed there's no way 100 percent, we have not failed we've definitely passed this but it's the grade that's what i'm worrying about i'm thinking oh, could we have lost marks on this for example in my part of the poster i was talking about the cast tool that we use to appraise our research article so I just summarised the pros and cons of that and what I should have said instead of pros and cons is strengths and weaknesses and it's just little things like that I thought oh why didn't I say strengths and weaknesses of the article that sounds much better than pros and cons Ugh. so I'm hoping that's not going to go against me because what I actually said was really good information and I really got my teeth into it and found some really good information from from that so I'm hoping they're gonna listen and take on board everything we've said. And there's nothing I can do now anyway. I need to just switch off. I've got a day off today. I am going to, oh I need to, oh my God, I didn't tell you. So I got to uni yesterday and I was walking up the steps and I was like, I forgot my ID. 
I forgot my ID. Oh my God. So then it just threw me, it threw my whole day off. And then I got really nervous. I was physically shaking. I was like, oh my God, I forgot my ID. I just, what am I going to do? Something so small like that just completely through me and I, oh, I was panicking so much I put it on Twitter I was like SOS I forgot my ID what do I do am I going to be able to sit this exam oh my god because the rule at our university is you have to have your ID and I was like I haven't got my ID I'm sorry I haven't got my ID so then I had to fill out a slip and now today on my day off I have to go back into university with the slip and my ID oh, that's it I did show them my driving license just to show that I am who I am I'm not an imposter trying to pretend to be Claire and do amazing but no Anyway, forget about it. I forgot my ID. It's fine. It's over. I'm going to go in today, show it. It's going to be amazing. Fingers crossed we've done enough. I mean, I've looked at the marking criteria. I've looked at the assignment brief again. And according to that, we've covered everything. So I can't imagine we've got a low grade for this because I personally think, I mean, I am biased, but I think we've done really, really well. Fingers crossed. So today is Friday. Friday the 13th, is it lucky, is it not lucky? Who knows? But today has been a great day so far. So this morning I went to a reflection conference at the university and myself and some of the students came along to do a talk to lecturers at the university. So it was really strange being on the other side. And even though I've done talks at the university before, this was a little bit different because it was to the actual lecturers, so it was really bizarre and I was nervous, of course. So after the talk, we went upstairs and we did a group work session where we had marshmallows and some spaghetti as above, and we had to make the tallest tower out of these items. So we came third, although technically we came second because the people that won, their tower fell down before the time was up, so that's not allowed. Pretty sure that was against the rules, so we came second didn't come third. It was a really good experience. Um, my hands were absolutely filthy and covered in marshmallow. It was fabulous. So we got to eat some marshmallows. Don't tell anybody. And then after that session, we got free lunch. I know I keep telling you I am in it. If I've got something to do and there's free lunch, I am there. And there's loads there. There's wedges, there was salmon skewers, chicken skewers. We had onion bhajis, we had samosas, we had wedges. We had some sort of like a Spanish frittata, I think. We had like potatoes and vegetables and eggs and things in it. We had ice creams. Oh my God, we had ice creams. So they brought these big containers with ice and things in and they just filled them up with ice cream, different varieties for us. So yeah, so it, all in all, it was a great lunch. Always love a good lunch and I'm home videoing this so that's all I've done today it's about three o'clock now so I'm gonna go I don't know what to do actually I don't know whether to finish my rationale or have the afternoon off relax and then I can get on it tomorrow because I've got a whole day off tomorrow so I could probably spend tomorrow doing it actually have the afternoon off shall I do that We'll decide after. Anyway, so I've got the weekend off now. I'm actually on a bank shift on Sunday, so I haven't technically haven't got the weekend off. But I've got my bank shift Sunday, I can't wait. Then I'm in back to uni Monday, Tuesday, nine till five, and then I'm off again. Like we're only in two days next week, which is strange. So I'll see you all next week. Thanks for tuning in as always. And if you're watching this, I'm probably on my bank shift right now because it's gonna be Sunday when I post it. So I'm probably on my bank shift. I'll probably love in life. And I'll See you next week.